orange flavor mother Hey everyone, it's King CK here with Building Magic Day 6. I'm um, sorry about that this one's a little bit late. Um, and that we are... I'm actually kicking it out to you day 7 and I'm not going to... Well, I'm going to bump day 7 and day back. But today we got a big huge thing to talk to you guys about today. So today was kind of a, a big first thing for both OIO and Building the Magic. Uh, two things happened today. We did our very first live stream. So make sure you guys uh, follow us on Twitter. I've been trying to get you guys to follow on Twitter. So that way, when I start live streaming, I can kind of send a tw tweet out so you guys can watch the live streams. And if you guys really want to, make sure you guys leave a comment and I'll start recording the live streams and actually kick them out to you guys as videos. Second thing that happened today, which is a pretty big deal, is so, if you guys know, there's a server called MC Disney, which ours is loosely similar to. We're not based up in any way, but it's loosely similar to the how, how the server works in terms of showcase and not build. And that's just how people will show up, come and view it, and not actually build. And and that was kind of... Uh, so today with MC Disney, they have a radio show. And so I was invited on with... I was going to have Chris come with, but by the time he was online, we had already started the segment. But so today we actually had... We were uh, interviewed, uh, I was at least, on the show. And I recorded the audio clip, which I'll play it at the end for you guys if you guys want to hear. Otherwise, you guys can just click away at the end. Um, so now on to what's new. So as you can tell, I've been wandering around the top deck here, flying around. As you can tell, we got the back smokestack in, the back pool, and this just kind of the whole entire exterior has been finished. Um, and then I also posted the renders on their website, which I'm going to post them over on Operation Infinite Ocean as soon as I'm done filming. Um, also I started on the, let me open this stupid door, there we go. I started on the teen area, which I think I'm going to rip this all out and redo it again. Because I actually looked online what it really looks like instead of just the floor plan. And so, that's pretty much it for top deck, other than some new add-ons. And let's go down here. Try to use the front escalator if I can stop lagging. There it goes. Usually Minecraft just lags a bit for me every once in a while. Why in the world is it lagging so bad? I'll fix this later. Um, Alright, down we go. Down the elevator. You see, I always get lost in these floors. So, we'll run back here. And also, deck 3 uh, officially is done today. So that's also some news. As we go on down, I'll show you what's new on deck, three, or deck 4. So here's the atrium once again, which you guys have seen before. Uh, here's the Studio C area that that I said I was or that I was dragging my feet on building. So me and Chris built this today on the live stream. I pretty much just helped with some random stuff. He did most of the work with it. I built the bar back here. He built the stage, and we pretty much tried to follow it the best of our ability. So here's the Studio C area, and then we also worked on. On. Let me get down there. We'll take our elevator. Slash through. And it decided to warp me one too many floors down. And we finished the engine room today as well. Chris did most of the walls and lighting for me. I just laid down the main stuff. And so here we got the engine room, which kind of it's similar to Renata since I really had nothing to work with. I was looking online and I couldn't find really any pictures of their engine room at all. So pretty much just did what a normal ship's engine room would technically look like. So it's pretty much it for this area. And so I think this pretty much covers it. Um, yep, little engine coolers. And I think I'll warp on out here. And so left to do. Just a quick checklist for you guys, if for all of you who have been watching since day one, or just even started picking up the series recently. So now you're probably watching going, oh, the ship's done, the ship's done. Um, nope, we actually can have a little bit left to do. We have the front theater, the aft theater, uh, I think two more restaurants. Actually, speaking of restaurants, I have one more restaurant to show you guys, I almost forgot. Uh, I think we have the Oceaneers Club, the Oceaneers Lab, and then I 
think the flounder's nursery are left, and I think that's it, and then we'll do a little bit of random decorating throughout the ship. Uh, here's Palo, which is kind of their fancier high-end restaurant that's on the aft of the ship, which is uh, back-facing, which has, like, diamond backdrop in the back, all that fun stuff. So, um, that's pretty much it. Um, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe. Um, we're still trying to, well, I'm still trying to plan out what I'm going to work on next. I think Chris has his mindset on what he's doing next. So, other than that, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And then I uh, hope you guys enjoy this uh, audio clip from MC Disney. Well, uh, pretty much uh, me and the Chris, uh, if you don't know him already, he's done stuff such as the Arrowin. Uh, we pretty much decided we are going to build a one-to-one -one scale replica of the Disney Magic. Uh, it's been roughly about one to two weeks or so on and off. We usually build about three hours at a time, take a break, and then for about probably five or six days now. Yeah, uh, we were originally going to, but unfortunately, no world edit, and that's kind of a big thing for the size of a project. Yeah, I'll be sure to uh, pass the information along to Chris. Um, other than, not anything at the moment, but we actually are planning to do the dream as well. Um, so if you guys want to check that out, we'll hopefully be posting that on your guys' forums here in the next few days. Thanks for, Thanks for having me.